let's get straight into it. I am with the boys QPR, obviously. My dad, a uh, massive fan of QPR, so I put on the shirt, I put on the classic shirt, 90s shirt. Nice. I am now here to do better than what we're doing right now. So we are currently projected in 21st. I know it sucks. Going from first last year for the first three months to now being projected to get relegated. Being projected to get relegated. <laughs> Zero transfer budget. Our finances are screwed. They have now finally made it. So QPR are still paying back their financial fair play. We are very much screwed in that category. The squad. Here's my first observations of the squad, right? I'm actually quite surprised. So I've actually, obviously, there's a new football manager 24 setting. So the transfers that we got in actually in the current season in real life, they're still to happen. I kind of wanted that because to make it a bit more realistic. But going through the squad without them changes, I'm just going to tell you a few things of what I pointed out. Dieng's obviously not going to be here anymore. Um, so he's got the, obviously, the TRN logo there, but he's going to Middlesbrough. Powell's a good left back. I think he's quite solid he's got good stats in regards to everywhere very well rounded as a left back so i'm quite happy with how he's come out center backs half stars you're probably wondering where the hell is our center backs well the great start to qpr is that there are two starting center backs that are currently out injured you've got jimmy dunn my boy from burnley uh, he was cracking last year nearly our player of the year really quality quality center back but the only issue is that he's out for two to three months so we're gonna have to try and solve the center back troubles other center back Clark Salter. Now, I haven't seen him much in real life, but all I know is that he's a bloody good ball playing centre back, which is going to be very useful. He also plays on the left. Kakai's got to go blood. He is on way too much on a wage. He's on 5.5k and he's he's not very good. Field's quite quality. Good passing traits. A good deep line playmaker, basically, for the midfield for us. we got Dozzle. He's actually one of our highest paid at the club, which is a bit of an iffy one. Shares our boy. This man is going to carry us through the season. Just look at his stats, man. He's got greens everywhere. He is our star player. We have quite a bit of money, especially in the, in the uh, league. He's not even on that high a wage. He's on 10k. He's not even the highest paid at our club. I've actually entered contract talks because I just wanted to see what the situation is with Chris Willock. Now, in real life, it's going to be quite difficult because he runs out of contract next year and injuries has been beating his ass in real life. So that is tough. In this game, he basically wants 20k a week plus to stay at the club. Now... He is currently worth 4 mil. And we're looking at 60% transfer revenue. We've got a good amount of money to spend if we sell him. We've got Dykesy up front. Think of real life that he looks like an absolute you know, menace. You don't want to mess with him. But in real life, he can't even win a header. He is good in this game. He's always been good in this game. He's good in the last time I used QPR. I was even using him in the Prem last time. He's an unreal target, man. My man Begovic. He is an absolute machine on this game. Like a machine. He's going to be such a good championship keeper. I know he's old as hell. He's 36. I mean, that's not, that's not that old for a keeper. You know, he might have a few years in him. It depends if we send the championship or not. We'll look at that. But he is going to be important for our squad. Reggie Cannon. He's a good dribbler. He's a good attacking fullback. He's got great pace. He's got with everything, isn't he? He's got, he's got good tackling. Green's everywhere. So now Jack Colback, the ginger himself. My brother. In real life, he's been a bit dodgy. He's got a few red cards, but he scored a few goals and all. He's going to be incredible for us. So we 100% need a right attacking mid like badly like genuinely badly especially if with it goes but i've got some players and names in mind i've got on the shopping list depending on how much money i get in obviously basically went and just got on trial two for two weeks just to see how good the players are just some right attacking mids now usually before episode 24 you can't pick up anyone in regards to work permits you just have they have to be it eligible for work permit if you can't get one then you're not gonna be able to play but there's a new rule in football that you have four spaces to pick up foreign players that the class is like your essential players players that obviously have a massive impact to the football club our first real signing has just appeared nicholas pirini is in our squad as a championship attacking midfielder this guy is outrageous like 14 finishing he's got he's such good like advanced forward stats really but he can also pass the ball off the ball's great his flair's great his technique's great bro he's gonna be unreal for us i have no center backs for this game sanfield just got injured oh my god this is so funny I don't know how I'm going to do this. Can't I? Okay, the board expects a defeat. I have no centre-backs. I feel like this game we can take a loss. I'm going to have to use two injured centre-backs. I don't recommend this. It's about to get serious. Let's go. Confidence is probably like 40%. Here we go. First match. First match, boys. 
Period need another one. Field. Oh, not bad. Not bad. That's it, we'll look. Maybe one down the wing. Chair. Sure. Bro, he's injured already. I should not be playing with him. <laughs> Willock, he's in. Good save. We started well. That's what matters. Pierini. I'll do signing. Pierini. Bro, he looks like a player, I'm telling you. Our centre back line is so funny. That is all. Down to Pierini. And inside forward. We need to run it in. That is all. Pierini. Pierini. Pierini! Wonder what, boys. Oh my god, he looks like a bloody player. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That's it. Wait, right, is that a pen away? Bro. Oh, Chair just conceded a pen. A chair's having an absolute stinker. How is Chair doing this? It's going to be a goal. That's such a poor pen to give away on the corner of the box. Yeah. Such a bad pen to give away. We move. You've got to be kidding me, bro. <laughs> Pierini boys is out injured. It's a thigh, so it's nothing too drastic. Is he Burnley? Or is he Luton? No, it's Burnley. Like, see, Lyndon. And that is exactly why we got him as a target, man, boys. 2 1. We're looking for great balling. Bro, that left side is getting. Absolutely destroyed though. So nervous and extended highlights because I'm so used to key highlights where like everything's a goal if it happens. Field. Lovely play for field. Lovely play. Dykes to chair. Chair, you gotta score that. That's another chance though. Oh wait, my, my boys are playing terrifically, I can't lie. Away at Watford we're playing like this. Chair with this wing. Dykesy. Dozel? So Dozel was playing terrifically. I might not... Willock, that boy. It's 3-1. Chat, I can't really sell him. I don't want to sell him. He's playing unreal. Okay, second half. Got quite a bad centre back on, but hopefully, fingers crossed, we can make it work. I'm not going to change anything yet or tinker yet. I don't think we need to. We're playing well. We're not conceding too many shots. Andrew's down the wing. Oh, mate. Bro, that marking is horrific. Even Vendel, Vendel's just losing the ball. Oh, bro, this is what I'm worried about. He's not good enough. Is he on? Yeah. Nice one, Begovic. Mate, he makes... He makes me nervous. This makes me want to sign Willock as a contract, though. This is what I knew. I knew this is going to happen. He's trying to get that bag. Oh my god, I got so scared, but I went out top bins. But the animation on the net is so different this year. It's just got to happen. Bro, chair scored! Let's go! Ilias! What a ball, by the way, from Taylor. Is it Taylor? Bro, Taylor's got terrific ball delivery. Look at that for a ping. Oh my god, now let's keep it, boys. Keep it, keep the ball. Oh. What a pickup Taylor's been, free agency. Great pickup. Defend, boys. Oh my god, what a free kick that is. I first they have four minutes left still. They could actually do it. Bro, what did we just concede, though, boys? Look at this free kick. That's a banger. Holy. Begovic should be getting that, surely. Win that. Oh, Dykesy, that's terrific. That is that is why you're a target forward, buddy. Keep it, chair. Keep it. That's it, boys. Play it about. Pen? Pen, miss! Come on! Let's go! Let's quickly change the camera angle. Oh, my days, boys. We've, I think we've done it. Is it Dykesy taking? Yeah, it's going to be Dykesy taking. Put it away, son. Let's go. We've won the game. Oh, wait, we scored five goals, you know, chat. In the first game. What a game, boy. This has got to be first up match of the day. If there was one for the championship. But other than getting about 10,000 injuries. Mate, what a result. What an absolute result.
I'm proud of your performance today. Bro, we did that with no centre backs, chat. I can't believe it. When we have our centre backs in. Achievement. Oi, boys, we're second in the league.